Once upon a time, in a quaint village nestled amidst the rolling hills, lived a young woman named Aria. She was known far and wide for her fiery spirit and quick temper. Every small annoyance seemed to trigger her into a storm of reactions. People often whispered about her impulsive nature, cautioning each other to steer clear of her wrath. One day, Aria stumbled upon a serene garden at the outskirts of the village. It was a place of tranquility, where the air hummed with the gentle rustle of leaves and the melody of birdsong. Intrigued, she ventured further, only to find a humble wooden hut nestled amidst the lush greenery. Curiosity piqued, Aria approached the hut and knocked on its door. To her surprise, it swung open to reveal a wise old man sitting cross-legged on the floor. His eyes closed in meditation. I apologize for intruding, sir, Aria said hesitantly, but I couldn't help but be drawn to this peaceful place. The old man opened his eyes, revealing depths of wisdom that seemed to span centuries. Welcome, young one, he said with a serene smile. I am Master Zen. What brings you to my humble abode? Aria poured out her heart to the Zen master, sharing her struggles with anger and impulsiveness. I want to change, she confessed, but I don't know how. Master Zen listened attentively, nodding sagely as she spoke. When she finished, he beckoned her to sit beside him. The power you seek lies not in changing your reactions, but in understanding them, he began, his voice a soothing balm to her troubled soul. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction, Master Zen continued. But the true mastery lies in breaking this cycle. The power of not reacting is not in suppressing your emotions, but in transcending them. Aria hung on to his every word, her heart yearning for the wisdom he possessed. But how do I achieve such mastery? She asked, her voice tinged with hope. It begins with awareness, Master Zen replied, his eyes twinkling with insight. Observe your reactions without judgment or attachment. See them for what they are. Fleeting moments in the vast tapestry of existence. With each passing day, Aria immersed herself in the teachings of Master Zen, striving to cultivate the power of not reacting. She practiced mindfulness, learning to observe her thoughts and emotions with a sense of detachment. Slowly but surely, she began to feel a shift within herself, a newfound sense of peace and inner strength. One afternoon, as she strolled through the village marketplace, Aria encountered a situation that would test her newfound resolve. A merchant, known for his sharp tongue and quick temper, hurled insults at her without provocation. In the past, she would have reacted with equal fervor, escalating the confrontation into a full-blown argument. But this time was different. Instead of retaliating, Aria closed her eyes and took a deep breath, channeling the teachings of Master Zen. In that moment of stillness, she felt a profound sense of clarity wash over her a realization that she had the power to choose her response. With a serene smile, Aria opened her eyes and met the merchant's gaze. I wish you peace, she said softly, before turning and walking away. The merchant stood rooted to the spot, his mouth agape in disbelief. He had expected anger and hostility, but instead, he was met with compassion and grace. Word of Aria's transformation spread like wildfire throughout the village, inspiring others to seek out Master Zen's teachings. In time, the once tumultuous young woman became a beacon of light and wisdom, guiding others on their journey towards inner peace and enlightenment. And as for Master Zen, he continued to impart his timeless wisdom to all who sought it his legacy living on through the hearts and minds of those he touched. For in the power of not reacting lay the key to true liberation, a journey that began with a young woman's quest for inner peace and ended with the realization that the greatest strength of all resides within the depths of the human soul. This is God of Motive. Thanks for watching and stay focused.